Twelve dreams for the Red Queen under crown of stone. Eight voracious beasts born from eight restless nights. Four nails piercing the flesh of the sinner. One prayer for the summoned called by this song. Tis perhaps the countdown to oblivion for the once proud city of London. Tis perchance her inhabitants last dance alone to face death and pestilence. Confronted by the eerie and unknown, mortals became desperate for answers. A flock's flight makes for an omen, the falling of a star, a dire presage. Turning to priests for interpretation when there was no reason to be found. When religion failed, men turned to science. I saw them build such vain cities, crafting machines made for endless war. New questions flourished as old answers withered. What is darkness but lurking sun? What is wall but enslaved stone? What is glass but tortured sand? What is song but a call to arms? What is hate but jilted love? What is life but death? Pending. Death. These patrols are after me! Please, boy! Watch no, out! No! No! Don't shoot! This is a nightmare! I need to get out of here! This can't be happening! Over there! No! Please! Stop! I mean you no harm! What's going on? Oh, Mary! What have I done? What's all this about? Now, I can defend myself. Let it come! Kill the thing! Who are you? Stay back! Sorry, but you left me no choice. Who are you? Stupid beast! Sorry. No! Please! Stop! That's a light fire! No. Who are you? There's one of them vermin! What do you want? The sun. It feels like it's burning me to the bone. I need to find somewhere to hide. Let me go! I need to find shelter! in my head. If I'm not mad, then 
It must belong to the one who made me what I am. I must find him to understand what I have become. These people want me dead. I need to leave. I'm still in Southwark. Over there! Die, Burnley! Go back home. My poor sister. If only I had controlled my need for blood. Mary, someone will pay for what the dizziness from the jump. I can now control it. I can't believe I'm doing this. I have this first for what will London have to say to me. I have so many questions unanswered. Fresh blood. The smell is so strong. At last, a little life. No. I'm you. I'm just. Yeah. No. Good. What? Yeah. What? This is no place for you. It's a bit of something. I've been then I've used. I've used. I should know how. I. Mm. If Swansea is not my attacker, it means somebody else came here tonight. So I will get to the bottom of this intrigue. What's been done to me? To this city? Fresh blood. The whole building reeks of it. The scent is so strong it makes me... Dizzy. This place reeks of bloodshed. This creature is bedeviled. I must put it down.
William was another. This poor creature can't be my maker. Could it be some subspecies of vampire? I must find a place to analyze the blood. Where are we headed? We're on our way to the Pembroke Hospital. It's just across the canal. They'll have a bed for poor Mr. Hampton. William was... What manner of creature was he? Predator, prey, villain, and victim. Who can say? The important thing is that he's been stopped. Duly noted. And the woman? What... Who is she? What woman? Oh, don't play me for a fool. You use me to locate that... Skull, you must know who she is. And I thought you a gentleman. You shouldn't talk about a lady behind her back, but I will tell you she values her privacy. Hmm. Were London as peaceful as she appears from the middle of the canal? If only that were the reality of the situation. To be honest, I've always tried to avoid this part of town. Pembroke Hospital is the last bastion between the rest of London and the epidemic. The flu has decimated the East End, and the war still rages. Welcome to the front lines of a plague. This is where you work, Dr. Swansea. I am the administrator of Pembroke Hospital. I thought you were here in service of your mysterious order, the Brotherhood of... Of St. Paul's Stone, yes. But first and foremost, I'm a man of science. A physician, like yourself, Dr. Who? Reed. How do you know who I am? No need for modesty. You are Dr. Jonathan Reed. A surgeon of some caliber and renown, if I'm not mistaken. You are correct, sir. I knew it! I had my suspicions. But when you took the blood sample from the corpse of poor William, I was certain. Dr. Reed. Marvelous. Have we met? I attended three of your seminars before the war. I have the utmost admiration for your research. And what a turn of fate. England's most esteemed blood specialist returns to London a vampire. <sighs> that word, again, from a so-called man of science. I understand. Traditionally, the role of science is to refute myth, but when myth walks among us, the Brotherhood of St. Paul has dedicated its purpose to their study. There's so much for you to learn. Of that, you are right. Well, then let me be blunt. Join my staff at Pembroke Hospital. As a physician. I suspect you'll not find a better post of employment to contemplate your uh, predicament. This is sudden. I was returning home to see my sickly mother. But alas, that was before contracting this... affliction. Dr. Reed. Take a moment to consider. The post would be for the night shift, providing a good explanation for your absence during daylight hours. You'll be adequately reimbursed and have a place to hide. I even had the forethought to bring some clean clothes. So, what do you say? It seems I have little choice, but yours is a generous offer, so I thank you. Brilliant! Oh, Jonathan, this is one for the book, and the beginning of a beautiful friendship. I was beginning to be concerned. Worry no more, Nurse Crane. For I bring good news. Oh, Doctor, what a night. We lost two more patients. Nurse Scow said she couldn't take it anymore and resigned. Yes, well, I'll make a new rotor in the morning. In the meantime, find a... Oh, good bed for Mr. Hampton. Be sure to pay attention to his needs. Of course, Doctor. Oh, and Dorothy? Yes, Doctor? 
Dr. Reed here has just returned from the front. He served King and Country and will be joining us here at Pembroke. We're very lucky to have gained a surgeon of his talent, and one so experienced in blood transfusions. That is good news indeed, Doctor. <laughs> oh, yes. Here at Pembroke, it's not what we have, but what we haven't. It's only thanks to Nurse Crane and the staff that our ship doesn't sink. If you have any questions, just ask her. Duly noted. Thank you. Your assistance is required, Dr. Swansea, immediately. Welcome aboard, Jonathan. We'll catch up after my rounds. You're coming, Nurse Crane. I'm coming. Rotten or pristine, each heart contains the of life. Drink at this river, dry it all. Sup, and all yet, Father. Rotten or pristine, each heart contains the seed of life. Drink at this river, dry it all. 
So, and oh. yeah, fall. Sometimes let his prey go, but no famished hunter can run for long. Hurry now. Don't I've all thank, the dogs thank, yet. Thank. Good. Uh, did. Uh, good. Dr. Swansea is right. This place seems perfect to conduct my research. You're not what you were. I'm not that. This must be the place. It's definitely away from prying eyes. Relegated to the shadows. A kingdom of my own. At least I won't be sleeping in a coffin. William Bishop's blood is much more unstable than human blood and shows extensive mutation. But this is not what happened to me. I must keep on searching. The sun is about to rise. I can feel it. I'll continue tomorrow night. I have so much time now. If I'm to stay here until my research is complete, I'd better learn to hide my true nature from the mortals. But what about my thirst for blood? I'm across. No, I'm how if this perhaps is the. Voices in the garden. I should investigate. If they were to find somebody. and that might prove itself useful. Behavior is similar to the infected William Bishop. Must this key will surely grant me access to the basement.
These skulls feed from corpses and the husks of animals. They're not of the blood. I'm not sure I can defeat them without becoming stronger. To drink blood is so tempting. Yeah, you've dude. meant you always knew the words to calm the children. As for me, come Wait, I, I, you, could you do you? you I, Don't waste your time with me. The bus is an ex- The flu took my deal. You're in. I know you- 
Patients and staff might know something. I'll start my investigation with them. You're sure you don't come back? This man has been savagely attacked and dragged to the floor.
free checkup in Whitechapel. What is Nurse Crane up to? I really must find her. I need someone who can read this. It what yeah, yeah. you
Neighborhood is linked somehow to the kind Lady Ashby's blackmail. First, let's find this Petrescu fellow. Fuck you all! Fuck you all! Stop it now, Albert! Stop it!
good at that bit. To enter that house, I must discover who this man really is. Maybe I could start by observing what he's up to. I must talk to that journalist or the person. They must know about Darius. Nearby the church they just mentioned. Come on, take a look. Don't be afraid. Not the content of Darius' letter to his children could give me more leverage to enter. Darius is a bit less of a mystery now. It should not be that difficult to incite him to let me in. Come on, Barrett, you know the game you pay for this. I will return later. Mr. Bu Don't yet. He's going 
to con What do we have here, nurse? Patient Razvan Vasily. Aspirin and salicin, you say? Why not some warm milk and a kiss? It's too dangerous to operate with these convulsions. Right then, Nurse Crane. He's still bleeding, Doctor. Yes. Yes. Good. A dose of epinephrine, now. Yes, Doctor. We've lost the pulse. He, he's gone, Doctor. Yes, we did everything we could. Truly? Everything you could. Is that how you'll report this in your log? Is this how the war went, piling up one poor corpse beside the next? This was not an influenza-induced seizure. I've never seen symptoms like these on the continent. Neither have I. But the previous symptoms leading up to this attack were the same, indistinguishable from the epidemic. No. There was something more vile in these reactions. Something... primitive. There have been numerous reports of mental breakdowns caused by the fever that accompanies the flu itself, Doctor. Yes, but... I'd best take some samples of the blood for analysis. I suspect it was more than in uh, Doctor You've convinced me of the sincerity of your actions. Human blood. Whoever left these marks did so. Hit it, boy!
This any I'm late I'm 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 I must quickly analyze the blood I took from Nurse Crane's patient. So lucky to have Dr. Reed, you know. Good to do Razvan Vasily was infected by Spanish flu, but also has the highly unstable blood of the Skulls. Is the London vampire epidemic transmitted through the flu? I should talk to Dr. Swansea about it. If this... I... This... I... There's... What? what? And will... Yeah, I'm much... I... I...
I never thought I would have to attend my murdered sister's funeral. Mary, I can't forgive myself. I'll find the truth about what happened to us. I swear. I need someone who can read this. Since I can't reveal myself to my mother now, 
I must find a discreet spot to attend the ceremony. I... Let Fit John... John... Don't... I'd... Uh, this... What should I do, then? St. Mary's Church is not far... Did Georgie go? These immortals try my patience with their plans and unsolicited counsel. The chair. I there are like you the gym in my she are what are you Whatever happened on this dock is between my sister and I. It does not concern God at all. for me, pretending to know how I should feel or behave. So the vampire who made me is some sort of disembodied entity? Or was he just projecting this vision in my mind? <sighs> Maybe Edgar can help me. The, the human... I, 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 you please should say... The... Sean Hampton lives and breathes for the well-being of his flock. There's no other place he would go but the docks. Why? It seems the Prewin are redoubling their patrols in the district. I must be more careful.
Braille. I need someone who can read this. Are you all right? I'm, 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 well. These murders are the work of a vampire. I'm a trap. I'm a hoop. A vampire. What? Why? Why? Don't hunt. Is that? No. Or what? You are. What's it look like? Is that? Good. It comes of a sudden, night time, and innocence, and vanishes. Good. Claw, time. Murders by night. Your sewage is my business. Times like these, these are the good kind of prey like I hunt, my lady. Foolish girl and her pretty principles. She's got no idea who she's dealing with. Not a drop of blood left in his body. Um, uh, I read. I want to good. Watch yourselves. This one. Of them. Like the guard of Prewen is on Sean Hamilton's trail, too.
Watch out, boys! are deep, the result of rabid rage. If this is Sean's doing, he's become a murderous beast. What's it? Uh, what? Pick up. Uh, take the hood. We'll have a talk when you've returned from the sewers, Dr. Reed. It's in the pits, where the city is darkest, the place you'll find your light. We shall have a good chat later, Dr. Reed. It's locked. It's locked, all right. Greg, not show.
So that's it. These wheels control the water level. That doesn't work. to respect the laws of Ascalon! I am Fergal Banch, the hand the cr- This isn't the blood of a vampire, but it will quench your thirst. This is Ardo. Wait. Thank. Please. If I. I... Ha. The... This... If... Ha. No. I... Ha. Hello. Mm, I've. I. I... You. I... With oh. ein Sch and what qu
It's locked. It's locked, all right. You... I believe I've learned all I need to know. I'm so... Let... Give yourself over to God, Doctor. Expel your orgy... My discoveries. Vampire blood would enhance... Another corpse thrown in the street. Twenty-nine Pretty Orchard Street. This is it. What's in there for me? There's been a fight here. Right then, it's a sick game, but given no choice in the matter, I might as well win it.
I won't let you escape very fast, but I'll catch you. Stay away! Steady, boys! We've got one of them here! They've all been butchered. I can still sense a presence. Thoughts are just to die for. Abomination, kiss me again. Just as you did to...
as I shed one last red tear for my fallen sister. I realize the entire world now revolves around this singular word. The epidemic that has stricken London is not the Spanish flu. It is transmitted through the blood via violent biting, turning survivors into frenzied immortals. I am Dr. Jonathan Reed. I am a vampire, born anew into an age of death and pestilence. While plotting factions close in around me, I am sworn to find the source of this epidemic. I am convinced greater perils are still to come. I know the answers I seek are hiding in our blood. Good. Good. Do you... I... No, what no? Do you And good. The war. Whatever this poor woman did, nobody deserves this kind of punishment. So this is where she lives. What a splendid house.
I, there are many. We I, if I must. I. I. I'm, you. If that is. You. you I. And will, I. Will, could you I, then? Thank you. I appreciate the advice. So, time to visit the Asgard. Was the vampire I saw earlier? This war takes no prisoners. The West End. Never have I felt so sad to be back home. You are Fresh water. As long as it's not holy water, I'm not going to use it. Look lively! It's on to us! The Ascalon Club, the heart of British vampire society. Good evening. I'm well. Do you need it? I'm. Thank <laughs> you. 
There has been quite a battle here. I'm sure the Ascalon Club has the money to replace the furniture. Thank yeah. My, uh, what the epic? We you talk it. What I uh, uh, that you have the uh, so, I, uh, Yeah, uh, what well, uh, I silent falling last night in the West End, and I spotted in the foreign aircon. This is an outrage. We shall chase these I think Lord Redgrave just suggested I was sired by an ancient vampire. Oh, you I you will oh, Good Yes, Jonathan. <coughs> Spending next summer in France. Do you let I'm a That building is under quarantine. Could this be what happened?
I've never seen such a radical mutation. Could it be a new stage in the disease's evolution? So the husband had an affair with Doris Fletcher. I'm... Why are vampire hunters sniffing around here? I need to find out what they are. Boys. <laughs> This girl took lessons at the famous Doris Fletcher acting school. Doris Fletcher seems to be the missing link here. It can't just be a coincidence. I could go to the acting school.
It's locked. No invitation is needed to enter this building. That can't be a good sign. No sign of a struggle. It seems Charlotte's friend knew the killer and let him in. Emily wanted to become a vampire. Blood. I should follow the trail. Someone you know, even someone you oppose the equality. And I, you my mind. Goodbye. She
There's an open window on the second floor. I should be able to get in through that. of you stands the tall queen. Can that be Doris Fletcher's voice? Where does it come from? Blade shot. <laughs> leave the theatre right now. The West End should be safe now. But London is not. It would be wise to benefit from the Ascalon's protection while I continue my I need to leave now. So Doris just needed to be close to her audience to infect them. Contagion through skin. 
very disturbing. I I I I I I I It looks like vampires have to obey Mendel's laws when producing progeny. Powers pass from one generation. I'm...
one's ready. We found one. It's one of them. I knew. Where is it? Crush the leech, boys. I'll send you to hell. I need someone who can read this. Close to Aloysius Dawson's mansion. Don't you know better? Ah! Uh. Uh. 
interfere with my... I'm you probably it. Tell something to do it. Wait, what heck? Good. I read the Red River, the song in the dark, the whispers of the sun. Dawson's mansion. Here I am at last. But the question remains. Am I ready to make a dying man my progeny? First, I... I've heard enough. It's time to proceed. Are you ready for immortality? Of Thank you, Lance Bearer. I shall take care of our new member when he awakes. For now.
Londoners are no match for me! You cannot win this! What is this truck? Are the vampire hunters here already? Done. some style. Blood of a true defender of this land will protect me. Come on, Reed. True light will cleanse you. gonna hurt. Down. 
Your poison is poison. Blood of a true defender of this land will protect me. Come on, Reed. Try something else. I know. It hurts, doesn't it? Show some style. Fight like a man. Close your eyes! This is gonna hurt. <laughs> Your poisonous bite is useless on me. You can't... There is no way you'll ever let me be, McCollum. You'll always hunt me down, won't you? There is no escape, Leech. Kill me now. For there is no way you can sway me to your ideals. <sighs> That's where you're mistaken. I'll spare you, McCollum. I'll offer you the mercy you never offered me. What is this ruse? This is no ruse, McCollum. This is me letting you go. After all, you and I are both trying to save this poor country in our own way. I'll kill you, Reed. Next time we meet, I'll end you. See? Progress already. You called me by my name. Until the next time. Goodbye, Hunter.
It's alive. It's alive. And it needs a name. I shall call you Lisa. Do you need... I will... Good... Do you... Why... So Prewin never left Doris's theatre after they invaded. They must be holding every year in their new hiding quarters. I order you to stop! Christ! He's dead! Doris Fletcher was about to become a disaster. I'm getting close to having all the evidence.
I should... Blood of a pure heart, garlic, blood of a king. I don't understand. Perhaps this is what McCullum drank. I had better keep that in mind. I should read this. Jeff, Doris and Harriet shared more than a hidden family bond. I made a mistake. No, Edgar. So Harriet Jones became the original carrier when Ed Steady gave her back. Go, go, go. I must tell Elizabeth. It was your blood Edgar used for his experiment on Harriet Jones. Now would be a good time to blend the recipe Marshall used when he fought the disaster. I think I know where to find what I need. Oh. 
All of your bloody leaders need killing. It's a leech! We will kill it! Easy does it, boys. We can deal with it. I cannot use garlic, but there may be a substitute in the Pembroke Hospital drug storage. There it is. Insulin. Much more efficient than garlic against blood poisoning and sepsis, and much less dangerous for me. Thank you, Dr. Polescu. There's one of them. Watch yourselves. Die, Vermin! All of you bloody leeches need to burn it, boys!
If McCollum really drank the blood of King Arthur, then I may have found another vital ingredient for my recipe. Could it not? I swear I would. Here is. Here give it off for you. Good. What kind of gentleman pays visits to people at this late hour? It's locked, all right. It's locked. What? Good. Tell me, how do you see the world these days? Yeah. <laughs> 
Let's be moving on. Burn it, boys! Die, vermin! The power of the Lord Elite! Elite! Whose blood could be purer than that of William Marshall? Lord Redgrave will have to spare me a trouble. I've got them. The I have you. I have you. in your house, Dad. Not mine. I'm... Londoners are no match for me! I yet yeah, what I I rarely fool and the Empress again. What are the cards?
We've got one of them. Demon. Back. Lens seems stable. Time to go and find Harriet in the sewers.
think it is? Oh, how infinitely, how intensely, how irredeemably are you all going to suffer now? No one could ever defeat you, mother of us all, for you are our every root and leaf. You've always been my most amusing son. Then go back to sleep, my queen, and smile at us from your dreams. Did they feel my wrath? Have they suffered enough? More than ever, mother of us all. Until the next time. Until the next time. It's over then, young Ekon. You have put an end to this terrible menace. Old Bridget? What are you doing here? This is my realm, Ekon. This is Suaskal territory. But they were all massacred by the monstrosity that Harriet became. Others will come, engendered by deceitful vampires. I don't mean you, of course. I was up it, no, I, who, I, you. it was about 200 years ago. Peace found me in time. And I sincerely hope it will find you too, now that all is over. No, it's not over. I may have ended the vampire epidemic, but I still need answers from the woman I love. I feared you would say that. Go then, young Ekon, and face your fate. Just remember that I'll always be here for you. London has been cleansed. This catastrophe came about when an ancient malignant will crossed paths with mortal imprudence. For now, we are safe. For now, my craving for blood remains. Red like hate, red like hunger, red as life and death, passing from one immortal to another, from predator to victim, patiently biding its time to rise again. London has been cleansed for now, but there's a simmering hatred, fear, and old grudges. When will we succumb, mortals and immortals alike? The next disaster is only a matter of time. My only hope now 
is to catch the woman I love, to understand why she fled, and unmask the secret that has been lurking in her blood for so long. Maybe it's just my imagination, but I think I smell Elizabeth's perfume. She must be here somewhere. This castle is falling apart. That sweet fragrance. Elizabeth's... What are these symbols? I can feel a mechanism, but it doesn't work. Voila. I have destroyed the disaster, this creature that Harriet Jones had become. The epidemic is no more, and London will recover. In time. Yes. You did well, Jonathan. You truly saved the city. Yes, we did. Despite all obstacles. I'm truly convinced we did it together, Elizabeth. I cannot bear knowing I was the cause of all this. Through the use of my own blood. No. This catastrophe was the result of unethical experimentation. And the will of a creature so inexplicably evil, she exceeds all the terrible wonders I have seen since my death. But it was my blood all along. My corrupted blood of hate. The poisoned blood of my father. A healthy carrier. That's all I am. William Marshall infected you. He is the true original carrier. Yes. But he saved me by sacrificing himself. Saved you? How? The tears of angels. The cleansing of impure blood by an older, more powerful blood. It worked on me, did it not? Yes. Blood is the definitive key to our species. Scowls. Cleansing, lineage, do you really think it worked? It has, Jonathan. I was nothing but a beast who took pleasure in slaughter. I roamed across Europe, reaping my bloody crop. It was the blood of hate, but my father's antidote cured me. You should have told me. No, Jonathan. The William Marshall myth lies at the heart of so many hostile plans. I could not risk jeopardizing his safety. So why did you come here? You knew I would follow you. I can't let you go. Because I know now the blood of hate is still in my veins. No one but I can put an end to this tragedy. I can help you. You can trust me, Elizabeth. No, I cannot. You chose to follow Ascalon's orders. You unleashed an immortal Aloysius Dawson into this already fragile and suffering city. Would your protege agree to speak with me? I have so many questions for him. Go on, Jonathan. But be careful. Yes, Sir William. My god. You really are William Marshall. 
You served Richard the Lionheart and his brother, King John. It is such a privilege to meet you. I did in my day. Come closer if you want to speak, for my hearing isn't what it used to be. I think your hearing is fine, sir. What is it you want, then? The blood of hate. How does it affect you? Do you feel it now? The blood of hate? Yes. Nothing more than a sneeze, really. A sneeze held for so long, you could blow a fortress down if you released it. Do you remember Murden, your maker? Only God is my maker, for he created everything on this earth. He blessed me with eternal life through his archangel, Michael. But Murden, Michael, is a vampire. He made you a blood-sucking creature of the night. Blood, yes. I used to drink it from the throats of the unworthy. Then I was punished for my deceit. During my penance, I rely entirely upon my sweet Elizabeth. We could set you free. Let you out. Isn't that what you want? I pray for the day I'll see the sky again. I have all but forgotten its colors. I could walk and do so many things beneath the stars. But I doubt it would be wise to release me. Then will you stay here and repent? Elizabeth told me it will not be long now. I cannot wait to feel the sweet caress of her hand on my cheek after so long as she releases me. I am Dr. Jonathan Reed. How could I trust you, Jonathan? One prayer for the summoned called by this song. Child born from darkness, whose path he must find. Now the song is sung and your path chosen. England is safe, for you have prevailed. I wish you a peace duly earned for the centuries yet to come. And they will come. I bid thee farewell, my champion bittersweet. My queen sleeps once again, and I'll soon join her slumber. Until alas she rises, woken by the hunger never fed.
mit einer Wedding, Jonathan. What have you become? Good club. known you were one of them, Johnny. Why was I so blind? said even those few who offer help always want something in return and he was right Find my killer. Betrayer. 
Anraten. monster of all, her own son. If I... Good. This has been proven by many. Good. Uh, then, oh. huh?
Was I that evil to deserve such punishment? My only regret is that no one will mourn me. For I have never been loved. I never had any luck in my life, and now I die alone. is so cold. I hoped it would be more meaningful. It's locked, all right. And I'm not ready. Father.
good. I'm... looking for. Mother, were you right all along? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. Good in surgeon. The greatest. I'd like white. Sorry, Nurse Branigan. I won't witness the great doctor you were destined to be.
killed, extorted, stole. Now I die. Fuck it. I lived the way I wanted. Good job. Um, you Oswald, I'm sorry to leave you alone. Avenge me, my love. So you were the proverbial wolf amongst the sheep, sir. I should have killed you for the sake of many. It's locked, all right. Take care of the sick. 
of the poor Dr. Tippets.
boys. Shit, where is that? Running completely amok. Good evening. Oh, uh,
sweet queen. Who will protect you from yourself? Will you cry for me? Sabrina, my friends, what will they become without me? If only I could tell her, tell them. Too late, too late. Good, Doctor. Tell me, who will take the blame for your murders now that I'm dead?
So my Andrew was right. Monsters exist. The guard will nail you down, vampire. My son will kill you. Vampire kills in utter silence. Good. Expected. Thank you, Dr. Reed, for in the end, you made me fulfill my destiny. This place has been ransacked. They've all been slaughtered. Pre-one. No, not their style. I bought. I Give me... 
If I had stood by your side, we both could have changed things for good round here.
scowl voices in the garden. I should investigate. If they were to find somebody... Princess, flee away while you can, for all is lost. land together and forever. Thank you. 